La President Tong Lun Si Sulit and Japanese Prime Minister Kishida Fumio held bilateral talks in Tokyo with the latter pledging support for Laos' socioeconomic development and his presidency of ASEAN next year. Let's take a photo first. Welcoming President Hong Lun, Mr. Kishida expressed his desire to work closely with Laos to further develop bilateral relations on the occasion of the 70th anniversary of diplomatic relations between the two countries in 2025. The Lao leader made the first visit to Japan in four years to attend the 28th International Conference Future of Asia being held in Tokyo during May 25th to 26th. At the talk, Prime Minister Kishida stated that Japan, as a strategic partner, will continue to support Laos' social and economic development through cooperation in human resource development, which lays the foundation of the country's development and fiscal stabilization, among others. In addition, Mr. Kishida expressed his desire to work together on new challenges, such as strengthening cooperation under the concept of the Asia Zero Emission Community and utilizing digital technology. Mr. Kishida said that Japan will continue to provide utmost support in various forms to Laos, which will serve as the chair of ASEAN, the 10-member regional bloc, next year. Bearing in mind that Laos will serve as ASEAN chair and that 2025 will mark the 70th anniversary of diplomatic ties between the two countries, the leaders agreed that their strategic partnership will be further developed. President Hong Lun expressed his appreciation for the warm welcome extended by the Japanese side. He expressed his appreciation for Japan's continued support to Laos in various areas and spoke of his desire to continue strengthening cooperation with Japan, an important partner for Laos, including on new challenges. President Hong Lun congratulated Japan for the successful hosting of the G7 summit in Hiroshima and said it was imperative to solve the issue of the international community through constructive dialogues. The two leaders confirmed that they will closely work together in dealing with various issues. They also said they will continue to work together towards the ASEAN-Japan Commemorative Summit meeting in December.